Hey guys, Shane Starnes here with DroidMotorX.com. Today I'm going to show you guys the Jelly Bomb ROM from Incubus 26 JC on the Verizon Galaxy S3. Uh, this is a new custom ROM by Incubus. It's based on the TouchWiz uh, Jelly Wiz, but it's on Ice Cream Sandwich. So if we go to Settings and About Phone. You see that the Android version is 4.0.4. Uh, one cool thing about this ROM is that it has the latest baseband version, the VRLHE. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And then you see the build number there is Jelly Bomb uh, Release 3. So he's up to Release 3 here. Uh, the coolest thing about this is uh, that it is still TouchWiz, so all of your TouchWiz features are going to continue to work on this ROM. Uh, but it does have an awesome custom theme. So you see everything here is uh, kind of themed blue, and everything is blacked out. So if we go into Messaging... You'll see that it's all blacked out there. If we go to like our Gmail, everything is blacked out. One thing that I like about this blacked out Gmail is that if it's not been read, you can definitely tell that you haven't uh, read that email. Uh, in previous versions of the blacked out applications, it was kind of weird because your unread messages kind of... Um, appeared to be the same as your red messages uh, so that's been kind of fixed in this version let's see contacts are blacked out phone is blacked out calculator looks really sweet on this build it's all blacked out and themed um, as you can see your pull down bar has been themed uh, you have some custom toggles here and you do have your brightness slider um, and of course the pull down logo down here has been changed to say Android which is really cool if we go back into our uh, settings actually the quick panel settings you see that you can actually choose which widget buttons you want on your widget toggle bar uh, and you can also change your brightness modes here as well and you can change your sound modes there and then you can change your button order so like I have the Wi-Fi hotspot at the very top I found out that the Wi-Fi hotspot toggle, for some reason, I could not get my tablets to connect, so I had to download FoxFi, which works perfectly. I may have just needed to reboot my phone. I haven't really checked it since I rebooted my phone. Uh, so the Wi-Fi hotspot toggle may very well work, and I just needed to reboot my phone. I'll have to test that later and give you guys an update. Uh, other than that, the ROM, even though it's Ice Cream Sandwich, you see it runs very smoothly, and uh, it is themed out really 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 nicely if we go into settings uh, not a lot here has changed you do have your developer options and that's really about it but this is jelly bomb for your android device it's just a more custom version of TouchWiz ice cream sandwich for your verizon galaxy s3 uh, to install this you'll just want to grab the rom from the link in the description boot into recovery and you just wipe data Wipe cache, wipe Dalvik, and install the ROM. G apps are included, so you don't have to worry about flashing a separate G apps package. So once you get here, you'll just go to wipe, factory reset, swipe to wipe, cache, swipe to wipe, Dalvik cache, swipe to wipe. When everything's been wiped, you just go to install, and you will find the Incubus Jelly Bomb ICS uh, version 3, and you'll select that and swipe to flash. Just make sure you're flashing the correct thing. And then you go back and reboot the phone. So not a ton of customization in this ROM like with a CM10 or an AOKP, but it is running TouchWiz and everything is working uh, since you are running TouchWiz. That's been the Jelly Bomb ROM by Incubus26JC. Uh, if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to click the subscribe button right there. Give this video a big thumbs up if it helped you. And you can find more of me at droidmotorx.com where I'll have the latest in Android and tech news. Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one.